what I was curious about is, you know, as soon as you guys learned that, that Arkansas State would be the, the new opener, uh, how much film have you personally watched of them? And uh, were you able to watch Saturday's game live, or are you just now maybe getting into the cut-ups for a rewatch of it? Like, so I'm just curious about how much of, of Arkansas State you've already been able to see now that it's game week. Yeah, so uh, as soon as we, we knew they were our opponent, they, they immediately loaded up some clips, or all the games from last year. So I've said I've been through probably 70%, 80% of last year's games of theirs, and then I dove into the Memphis game um, on Monday, but I also watched some of the lives. So, you know, our film staff does a great job with all that. So I've been, been able to get through a lot of their stuff recently. John Kurtz. Yeah, hey, Harry. Uh, coach had mentioned the other day using more of you guys as running backs, as receivers. Um, obviously, you're involved in the passing game somewhat anyway, but especially with COVID and, hey, you may be down a couple receivers for a week. What has that been like, and, and how, how comfortable are you uh, being a pass-catching option? Yeah, you know, it's, it's, it's been a little different, but not much. You know, um, as I've had the, another offseason to learn the playbook, I've, I've learned more about what the receivers do on certain routes and certain schemes. So, you know, I think it won't just be me. There will be, a, some, it'll be a, a lot of us running backs, you know, being able to do some stuff out of the backfield, but, you know, also on whatever, whatever, whatever it may be, sweep motions, pass routes, um, you know, anything. Um, you know, whatever Coach Mess needs us to do, you know, we can, we can step up and do it. You feel like game plan wise, uh, things going into week one here are similar to what a normal game plan would be, or does it change this year because there's so many unknowns? I think uh, the coaching staff's done a great job of making it feel as normal as possible. Um, you know, we had a normal Monday yesterday, a solid practice, and, you know, now we'll have a normal Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, and we've had a pretty normal preparation schedule, so. You know, I think the team feels good where we're at, and it's been pretty normal up to this point, so we feel good about it. Appreciate it, Harry. Thank you. Scott Fritchin. Yeah, hey, Harry. How are you doing? Good. How are you doing? Good. Hey, uh, talking with Skyler, obviously his senior season, he's been here forever. How have you maybe seen him really step up and, and take control on the football field over the past few weeks? Yeah, the thing about Skyler is he's just an amazing leader. Um, it seems like every year he's stepped up more and more as a leader in a leadership role. And, you know, even even more so this offseason with, you know, not a typical offseason and a couple months of quarantine, he's done a great job of, of leading the pack and keeping everybody positive, keeping everybody upbeat, you know, when things were unsure. But um, he's done a great job just, just leading the way and, you know, keeping everybody positive and I think now that we're in practice mode and game mode, um, he's just ready to go. He's he's a lot better this season than he was last year. He's so much more prepared. And I feel like um, I think he's going to do a great job this season. I can't wait to see what he does. Obviously, you're number one on the depth chart at running back. Congrats on that. It was probably expected. Um, behind you, though, uh, you have Tyler, and then you have the true freshman, Deuce Vaughn. And it's very rare that you have a true freshman cracked it too, too deep on – season opener what have you seen from Deuce Vaughn that allowed him to maybe elevate to that status yeah I think um I think his preparation is has set him apart a lot a lot of the times um I know in the summer back in the summer he was diving into the playbook and stuff and you know all our zoom meetings he he seems pretty knowledgeable about the offense and then he he had a great camp um just executed well when we needed him to and you know, he's he's a great he's a great dude out in space. So, you know, we can put him in different positions and he can do different things out of the backfield as well. So I think he's just done a great job learning the playbook. And, you know, he's a, he's a little confident dude. So, you know, I'm excited to see what he'll do this season. Thanks, Harry. Good luck. Thank you. Kels? Given kind of the randomness of uh, how – positive COVID tests can happen. What What is the reaction from the team when you find out one of your players is asked to quarantine or miss time because of it? Yeah, it's, it's like you said, it's random. And, you know, it's just more of a step up thing for whoever, what, whatever position group it is. Or, you know, it's always, you know, kind of a shock or whatever. But, you know, you only got a couple minutes to get over because then you got to practice, you got to lift, you got to whatever it is. So um, I think it's just we've talked a lot about it as just opportunities for other guys. And, you know, when somebody does go down with a positive test or, you know, close contact, whatever it may be, um, it's just a chance for somebody else to step up and make plays and or young guys to step up. So I think I think a lot of guys will have opportunities this year just because of the COVID stuff going on. So I think people just got to be prepared. And, you know, whenever their time comes, just make the best of it. What, what would be your scouting report on the uh, Arkansas State defense right now? 
Yeah, I think um, they gra- or they graduated a lot of guys from last year, but um, they filled some spots with some good guys, some transfers, but also some younger guys. Um, uh, mainly Oki front team, but I think they're aggressive and can make plays. And you know they got some good players, uh, good linebackers, and you know really I like their nose guard. I think he's a well technique guy. So I'm I'm excited to play against them. I think they're a good defense and just aggressive, and they can make plays. So you know we got to be able to execute against them.